This episode is all about split screen. We're talking about how to plan for split screen, the shots you need, and then putting it together in post. All right, guys, for the split screen, we are talking about using quick, fast edits, and we need to plan for that. So we're gonna use it in this scene when Ellie's looking at her dress, looking at her necklace, putting it on. You're gonna need a few good shots to make your split screen. I recommend getting more than you need. Be sure to add a variety of shots by switching your angle or lens. Ready, Ellie? All right, yeah, go ahead and put the necklace on. And now give me a look and then I want you to turn. You need to frame your shot correctly by leaving plenty of space around your subject. All right, and then let's get another shot on this side. I want you looking at yourself in the mirror. Hey, make sure you're out when you're using mirrors. Ready? And then let's get you putting on their necklace again. Give yourself extra time to reshoot the same scene multiple times. All right, guys, I think we got a lot of different angles and shots. Let's go take them and edit them. Thanks, Jeff. I'll take that from here. Hey, guys, it's Heidi. I'm going to show you how to do the split screen. So firstly, we're going to have to import all of our footage that Jeff just created into Filmora. So if you haven't already, open up Filmora and then go to Import Media Files, select the clips you want, and hit Open. So now all of our clips are in our library, and the first thing we're gonna do is hit the split screen button on the main menu. So we're gonna select, there's like a ton here to choose from, but we're gonna select just the first one. And as you see, there's a drop zone that appears here. And it just makes it super simple to use the split screen tool. So I'm just gonna drag the clips that I want into drop zone one and two and just see how that looks. You can apply a border or remove it. And you can also change the color of the border to red or green. But I like black, so I'm just gonna stick to black. And that's what we did in our video. So I hit okay and I just play the video and I, I can watch it. And if I don't like the position of where the footage is at any given time, just like here you can see that her face has been cut off. We can just drag that clip over and we don't even have to go back into the split screen tool, you can do that right from the timeline. And then when I hit play, I can see that the footage is just how I wanted it to be. Also, if you double click on your layer, it'll open the split screen menu back up and it'll show you the drop zones for that clip. And there's a really convenient little tool right here, click and drag, and it will allow you to adjust the starting point of that clip in the drop zone. So if I just wanted to start over here, then I could do that and just hit OK. Let's see how that looks. That's a lot better. I think that's a more interesting beginning. So after I've done that clip and I've refined it and I think everything looks great, I'm just gonna move the timeline marker to the place that I wanna add my next split screen. So I'll hit split screen. I'm just gonna choose this one. And we're back over into the drop zone. We're going to drag the clips we want back into the split screen and it's so simple and easy. It's really fun to use. It makes you look so professional with barely any work at all. One thing that split screen is really great for is highlighting features like what she's wearing or the necklace that she's putting on. And this is perfect for the video that we're creating, which is the lookbook. So I'm gonna hit okay and see how that clip looks there. I think that's just perfect. One thing I want to make sure is that at the beginning of this clip, um, I see her face a bit more. So I'm just gonna drag that down a little bit. And I think that's amazing. There you go. That's the different kinds of split screens that you can use. Thanks for watching, guys. All right, guys, that's it for this episode. I really appreciate you. Make sure that you subscribe. We have a lot of awesome content we want you to stick around for. Let's split. Let's split it up. Woo!
Wow!